He never leaves the seat up or wet towels upon the floor. The toothpaste has the lid on and he always shuts the door. She's very clean and tidy, though she sometimes may delude. Leave your things out at your peril. In a second, they'll move. He's a very attractive person, as are all his next of kin. Whereas she <laughs> likes lazy days, he'll still drag her to the gym. He romances her and dines her on cooked dinners and the like. He even knows her favourite food and spoils her day and night. She's thoughtful when he looks at her, a smile upon his face. Will he look that good in 50 years when his dentures are not in place? He says he loves her figure and her mental prowess too, but when gravity takes over, will she charm with her IQ? She says she loves his kindness and his patience is a must, and of course she thinks he's handsome, which in her eyes is a plus. They're both not wholly perfect, but who are we to judge? He can be pig whereas she won't even budge. All that said and done, they love spending time together and I hope, as I'm sure you do, that this fine day will last forever. He'll be more than just her husband, he'll also be her friend. She'll be more than just his wife, she'll be so made to the end. be there for you when you need it most, to laugh and cry with you, to trust and confide in you, to comfort and support you, and all that I have, I share with you. I promise to respect you and be faithful always. These promises I make to you for the rest of my life. When I first met you in college, I thought you were the most beautiful person I'd ever met. Thank you for agreeing to let me wine and dine you, albeit in Weatherspoons, on our first date. <laughs> From college to uni, I've never been prouder of you than when you graduated with your degree. Most people t tend to have beauty or brains, but you seem to have both. I love how loving, caring you are, and how you think about others before yourself. I love how competitive you are in everything that you do. And I really mean everything. I love all the little things you do for me. All the little surprises you surprise me with. I feel like the luckiest man alive to be stood here as your husband. And that he's always down to you. <laughs> Before we know it, today will be over. But I don't see this as something that is ending. I see it as the start of an exciting new chapter in our lives together and I'm sure you can't wait for this evening. My plan for today was to make this the best day of Kaylee's life and I'm sure with all your help here today, to, together we can for Kaylee. So I would like all of you to stand. And, and join me in raising a toast to my beautiful new wife, to Kaylee. <laughs> 